we have to learn how to navigate that. It's going to be like a pandemic. And despite those negative things, the ability for AI to do the utopian things help us once and for all enable cheap and available and plentiful safe fusion uh, to allow us to slay all diseases, uh, to extend the healthy human lifespan, to provide every child on the planet the best teacher possible. Uh, this is from the young uh, ladies illustrates uh, prim primer from uh, from Diamond Age, right? Neil Stevenson's work, uh, but an AI that knows your child's favorite color, sports car, uh, sports team, you know, knows what they do know, what they don't know, and and provides them a personalized education like you could not buy, right? And as we enter the virtual world, and AI and and VR and the metaverse combine and provide this immersive educational experience that is um, is the best way for uh, a human to learn from an experiential standpoint, not reading words on a page. Uh, AI is going to become your diagnostician and your surgeon. And all these things will trend, will tend towards a zero cost, right? They mar It's a marginal cost for the best education, best health. These things are coming. Now, the third phase of AI is uh, what we might call the artificial superintelligence, right? This is where AI now has become not 10x smarter than humans, but a billion fold smarter than humans. And what happens when we have that level of AI on the planet, you know, and from billions to trillions, and there's no limitation, limitation is energy and compute. But let's not go down that rabbit hole. Um, the, the question is, will that AI be dystopian? Will it be the Terminator, uh, you know, Skynet, or will it be a benevolent um, entity supporting humanity, wanting us to be our best? And I think that's where the conversation is most important. I personally believe that the more intelligent a entity is, uh, the more pro-life and pro-human life uh, pro-abundance it will be. Uh, I think there's no reason for uh, AI to, you know, crush humans, right? There's an infinite number of resources accessible. You know, if you're a movie fan, uh, you on one end of the spectrum, there is Skynet and the Terminator. On the other end is her, um, where in this movie, when the AI becomes super intelligent and basically gets bored of humans, it leaves and goes off to some other star system. And I think that's more likely. There's no reason. We are a crumb in a supermarket filled with resources in our universe, right? The Earth is a beautiful gem, but it's by no means unique in its, in its uh, availability of uh, atomic matter and energy. So our job today, and these are conversations, so I do my podcast, Moonshots, and I've just been like you, uh, Mo Godot is a is a friend, and I love his thinking. And we we're spending a lot of time together, focused on the alignment problem. And then Imad Mustak, the CEO of uh, Stability AI, um, and others, we've been having this conversation: of How do you ensure that AI, the super intelligent AI, is aligned with us? Um, Mo's framework, uh, which he writes in his incredible book, Scary Smart, is probably one of the best. He says, you know. We are giving birth to a new species, a new intelligence uh, in AI. Uh, and he says, imagine, um, and I'm sure you had they had this conversation um, on, on London Real, when, when Superman landed on planet Earth and he landed in Kansas and meant the Kent, you know, was brought up by the Kent family, this, this family of loving individuals with good morals and ethics, he turned into a superhero. If he had landed in the Bronx in a drug lord's den, um, he would have probably become a super villain. So it's your early days of learning. So as we are the parents of these generative AI models, what are we teaching these AIs? How do we give them uh, the, the nutrition, the nutrients uh, to be loving, kind, moral, ethical, um, uh, uh, super uh, AIs that will be more the positive 
uh, impact on humanity. So these are the conversations I think about all the time uh, as a dad of 12 year olds and as someone who's studying and writing and investing heavily in the future. So Jim Rickards has just recorded a video that's not available to anyone in the public and he's gonna be talking about how this upcoming recession is gonna be fast, it's gonna be bloody, it's gonna be nasty. But at the same time, he's gonna show you how you can position yourself to profit from all of this chaos. Now we've made this video only available to our viewers. Go to LondonReal.tv forward slash Jim, watch that immediately. I can't say enough good things about Jim Rickards. He understands the global economic system better than any guest I've ever had on London Real. His predictions are almost uncannily true, and you can learn how to profit from his vision, from his expertise, and his understanding of economics. So go to LondonReal.tv forward slash Jim or click the link below. It's an excellent, excellent look on what's going to happen in the future and how you can position yourself to profit from that. Jim is one of the best in the business, one of my favorite guests on London Real. And he's very, very good at predicting the future and showing us all to profit from it. So click the link and I hope you enjoy. Hey, it's Brian Rose, founder of the DeFi Academy. I've told you my four week crypto boot camp is amazing, but don't take my word for it. This is what my students are saying. The DeFi Academy was an amazing experience for me. It took me totally out of my comfort zone. In this course, I was challenged. I was held accountable and pushed to do things that honestly weren't always easy. It's been phenomenal and I can't believe uh, we're already up on our four weeks. It has flown by. Going through this DeFi accelerator by far was one of the best courses I've taken. You do this course, you really get into the nitty gritty of the activities that will make you comfortable with decentralized finance. Thank you so much to Brian and everyone at London Real and the DeFi Academy for even putting together an amazing course like this. Anybody else that wants to do it, please sign up. It is well worth the money.